If you feel like you're losing the battle with clutter in your home, I've got three simple steps to easily declutter any room in your home. So if you're feeling stressed out over clutter, stick around. Welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time you're visiting my channel, thanks so much for clicking on this video. My name is Pam, I'm a professional organizer, and I enjoy sharing all of my organizing tips with you here on my channel. And today, I wanna to share with you three easy ways to declutter any room in your home. So let's dive right in. The first step to easily declutter any room in your home is to grab some type of bin or basket. This is going to be what I call your relocation bin. You wanna set that bin in the doorway of the room so it actually blocks your exit from the room. Here's why you wanna do that. Have you ever gone into a room wanting to declutter and you find one item that doesn't belong, so you go and you take it back to the area where it does belong. But when you get to that area, you find something else that's out of place, so you pick up that item and you take it yet to the other location that it belongs. And when you're there, you find a bill that you forgot to pay. So you quick run to your office and you pay that bill. And while you're there, you realize that you forgot to call your friend back. So you go to call the friend back. And then while you're sitting at the desk, you notice that you left your cups and your dishes by your desk. So you run it out to the sink only to find that the sink is overflowing already. So then you go to stack the dishwasher. And before you know it, it's been three hours and you only took one item out of the room you wanted to declutter. That is where this relocation bin comes in. You set it in the doorway so that you can't leave the room. And any item that you find that does not belong in the room just goes into that bin. You leave it there, you do not leave the room. When you go to declutter a room, you stay in the room. So grab everything that doesn't belong and put it in that relocation bin. That's the first step. The second step is to ask yourself, why that item was left there in the first place? Was it because the process of putting it away was difficult or too time consuming? Knowing the why something got dropped somewhere will help you set up systems to prevent that from happening again. We often come across this with our mail. We will drop it because the process of opening it up and filing it or acting on it just takes too long or is too difficult. So what do we do? We just put it on a pile on the counter in the kitchen, right? For every item that you put in that relocation bin, ask yourself, why was it in the wrong place? And your third step for decluttering is to create systems that make putting those items away a lot easier and faster to do. So take those items, say what would make this easier to put it away and faster to put away that I'd be willing to do. And that's how you set up those systems. All right, so you want to do that with any of those items that you found when you were decluttering your room. You want to now set up the systems to make getting them into their proper locations easier. Okay, so those are my three easy ways to declutter any room in your home. Do you think this would help make decluttering easier for you? Let me know in the comments. And if you did find these suggestions helpful, would you let me know by clicking on that like button below? It really helps out my channel. Good luck decluttering and I'll see you in the next video. fellow organizers, if you liked what you just watched, here are two more organizing videos you might enjoy. Be sure to check them out. And if you found the information I shared in this video helpful, let me know by clicking that like button down there because it really helps out my channel. To get even more organizing tips, you can always follow me on all my socials. The links are in the description box below. Happy organizing!